admit it, you watch people fight it out from the sidelines and wish you could get in on the action. You've done your best Jackie Chan and Bruce Lee impressions from the privacy of your own bedroom. Yeah. At least I have. So what gives us this intrinsic need to fight? I'm at the Contender Gym, Dubai's first mixed martial arts center to find out. Mixed martial arts, popularly known as cage fighting or ultimate fighting, features a combination of grappling and striking skills. And in Dubai, fighting championships are becoming increasingly popular, attracting thousands of spectators and hundreds of participants. So Tam, why do you think people really want to fight? Um, I think more in general, not people, men. I think it's just one of those things men want to do, it's instinctive. Um, it's in their blood since the beginning of time. Men like want to fight, want to wrestle since the old Spartans and gladiators. And I think with the introduction of the UFC being so popular now on the show, it's just took off, and especially in the Middle East. And uh, I think guys there who are like, especially in Dubai when there's not a lot of activity to do, they've seen gyms like this and seen um, their stars like GSP and Hoist Gracie fight. And they're thinking, you know what, I want to try that. You know, whilst they're young, before I retire and get old and get married, let me give it a shot. And I think it's just one of those things guys want to do. Like, you know, guys like they like to drive fast cars, go out, just take risks, and that's one of those things, fighting, taking risks. So what makes mixed martial arts different from boxing and other kinds of fighting? Okay, boxing is limited. You only use your hands when you clinch your break. Mixed martial arts is the ultimate of combat. It's everything. You stand with your hands, you box, you clinch, you get close, you still grapple. You go to the floor, you still continue with submissions. It's every aspect of fighting in one. Basically, there's, there's an old slogan the UFC used, there are no rules. It's the most closest form to like real life street fighting, you know? How popular is mixed martial arts in Dubai? When I first came and I um, started MMA here three years ago, it was quite, no one knew. It took me a lot of time and effort just to get the awareness around. Now, it's taken off. I mean, I have so many members now that I've made two classes a day for MMA especially, because it's just, and especially from 16 to 20 year old kids, they're loving it, it's crazy. Even women, I've got about six, seven female um, fighters who join this club and they love it. It's just getting huge. Malik, you're going to be fighting in the upcoming Abu Dhabi Fighting Championships. How do you train for a fight? We train uh, six days a week, twice a day, sometimes even three times a day. Jiu-Jitsu, trying to do some boxing, Thai boxing, everything that can be useful in fight. Well, there's no way I'm leaving without throwing a few punches. And Tam, I'm ready to get some of my frustration out on you. You ready? One thing I've learned today is that professional fighting is ridiculously hard work. And although I clearly have the potential to do it, I think I'd rather see you in the crowd. Athena, get back in here, we haven't finished. We haven't finished.